Hello everyone, I'm in the process of replacing the fans on this um, system. I'm also replacing the liquid cooler and the case as well. But I wanted to put together a quick video because what I wanted to do was be able to use this remote control with those fans. Now this is a Rosewill remote control and came... You get one with the CPU controller and the three pack fan pack. So I actually have two of them. One is connected and this is it right here. It has its own proprietary connector. And what I did was I sacrificed the fan. I cut the wires to see if this controller here, sorry, can work with those fans. Because basically this gives you the control to use this right here you could switch colors do what you want to do but these fans are a little too brash for me so i want to use the other fans so you can switch between the motherboards all kinds of tricks you could have it do oh it's on the motherboard sorry you can have it do all kinds of tricks which is like a, i like that i want to keep that but the problem with the other rgb fans is that they don't come with a remote they give you a controller similar to one that i just showed you but you have to either use your reset button which is kind of cheesy to flip between the modes or you do or you have to open your case every time you want to switch the the fan colors which is kind of crazy so they either rely on the software from the motherboard to switch the colors and that's it but i wanted to use this because it worked fine with these fans and i like the idea of being able to switch and then have the remote and i can even actually shut it off which is i think is real cool so this controller is what i'm going to use and this is a good controller because the remote works without an external wire with a little receptor this all you need is this and you hook it up to the fans now this fan right here was on the back of the computer case and as you can see i cut the wires and what i did was i created if you look closely sorry about this this is the connector that was on the fan itself this right here it has five wires two was for fan control and the other was three was for rgb so I figured, well, if it's RGB, shouldn't I be able to hook up something to the RGB portion of the fans that I'm buying and then still be able to use the controller? So what I did was I created a wire, basically. And at the end, it has that connection at RGB. And this is what would go into the controller. So this end would go into the controller. This end would go into the fan RGB. Okay, with that said, here's the fan that I'm going to use it on. It's a Cooler Master fan, and as you can see, it has two wires. Now, one wire is the RGB that I inserted this portion in, and the other wire is just the, I think it's the PVM fan control right here. That's the fan control wire. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook up my wire to this, just the RGB portion, and then to the controller and see if it'll actually get the RGB portion to work with this fan. So I'm just I'm going to pause it and I'm going to connect it and I'll be right back. I'm sorry, before I show you the fan, I want to show you the details of the wire connection. So basically it's a three wires right here. And all you have to know is that the wire that has the color on it, the stripe, I mean, that's the wire that's apart with the three pin RGB. So you just make that one separate and the other ones are together and you're fine. So I'm going to hook this up right now. One end to the fan, the other end to that controller, similar to the one I just showed you, and you'll see how it works. Okay, I'm back. I connected that wire to the controller and it works. So now I have full RGP control of the fan. You can even switch back to the motherboard mode. Switch back to its normal mode. Does all the same effects. But now I'm not limited to those fans. So I could use this controller here 
there's another one connected i have two to pretty much control any rgb fan only downside is that those three fans that are connected now to the front they're gonna have to be sacrificed i'm gonna have to cut the wire on those and then create some other wires so i could do the same thing for the rest of the fans i've got another three fans that i have coming in for the front of the new case and i'm also going to connect the rgb to the controller for that um cpu cooler so there it is you can actually control any fan any rgb fans controller that's a rgb via remote if you're willing to buy a rosewell three-pack fan and sacrifice your fans all right that's it um seems to be working out good this whole system's gonna get taken apart and uh talk to you soon take care